All right, everyone, a quick update on GFI here. So Goldfinch, as of right now, is still macro bullish. As long as you're above 169, pretty much 170 here, uh, you're currently at 243. So as long as you're above that level on the macro scale, higher highs, higher lows, you are still macro bullish to continue pushing higher. Now, with that being said, you can see these candles here. Got stuck perfectly at the 618, held support perfectly at the 236 at 280. And then this large red candle here got stuck perfectly as resistance at that level. And that's why you're coming down here. Even though this candle looks good, there is no momentum. We can see that with the stock RSI, with the price action here, breaking the uptrend, hitting that first resistance, coming back down. So what that kind of tells me is the price of Goldfinch here, if you cannot get back above 280 here, then there's a good chance you come back down to these levels here and hopefully we hold to stay bullish or we're going to have a massive drop and break down and drop about 65% down to this dollar range, dollar seven to dollar twelve. Now, I don't uh, think that's going to happen right now. I think that's too massive of a drop. Uh, at this state of the game for GFI and the fact that it's holding here because you can see here that from where we are right now even if we pump up uh, even if we don't if we drop back down to the 0.5 and the 382 after getting stuck there you're going to drop anywhere from what is that 25 26 percent down to 30 percent so as long as you're below 280 on GFI you do have the uh, price of 169 170 here and you do have that 30 percent drop in play so that is in play right now as long as you're below these levels here so just keep that in mind and if we look down at the stock rsi even though it is lagging it is telling us that the momentum is clearly down it's back below 20 bearish cross breaking the uptrend hitting resistance coming back down so there's nothing bullish right now on gfi if you are bullish on gfi for the cycle of course then you take these opportunities at these levels that we're pointing out here uh to add to your positions here so if it comes down to 179 169 and then if it has that massive drop of 65 percent down to 112 to 107 then you take those opportunities also to add to your position down here you do not sell your position even though you're losing all your money uh, but you know everybody has a different game plan everybody's in a different stage of life and I understand family bills, all these different things, because myself, I lost all my money on two different assets, one of them being Arrow. I had to pull my money out because I do have bills and mortgages and kids and just everything going on. Uh, so as of right now, I am not in the game. Uh, but at some point, as long as we're holding down here at these levels and we're still bearish at the moment, I expect to get back in in the next couple of months, hopefully. But if the market turns around, so be it i will be happy for you guys to make money uh that is the name of the game here but that is the reason i make these updates is so you guys know these levels to get in at and then of course on the flip side of that we point out the potential levels we look a lot at the 0.5618786 retracement levels to take profit and then let a moon bag ride so Hopefully you guys are paying attention to these updates. None of this is financial advice, by the way. But looking here on GFI, so GFI, depending on how low it goes, it is going to change how high it goes at some point in the future. But as of right now, you're holding over the 382. You are bullish over this level at 170. And we do have our target here. You can see from today, that is a almost a 2,000% um, move. So that gives you a 21x. So a 21x on Goldfinch up to a four billion dollar market cap up to the uh, 1272 that is up to 52 dollars and that is a decent move there. So that is our target for Goldfinch here. Hopefully that helped. None of this is financial advice. I appreciate you all. Good luck, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.